All right, so trying to figure out the adjustments on this on these KTM 85 airports. Right now they just feel super choppy. Not super choppy, but pretty choppy. Too much bounce. My front end is way too stiff. I need to adjust the front end back down. It's just too stiff now. Do you think that's air or the compression setting? Any idea? You don't ever mess with Air Force, have you? So does it have good sag? So wherever it's a 2X, you can follow that one, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Too much. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's got a lot of sag. So you think it's so compression? It's got to be compression if it's fixable. So went down on the compression two more clicks i'm at 18 out on the compression now so. see what that does because i'm really choppy on the uphill climbs i need a little more just that, that initial impact i need to be a little more flush better better lighter yeah a little better we'll see on this next hill climb so that's where i could really feel it when i have i'm not compressed at all and i'm doing a gnarly hill climb and when as soon as it hit the chop hits the first piece of chop it was just super stiff oh. so it would bounce me and then i hit the next piece of chop and then i'm off the trail now is this chewed up anymore <laughs> stiff about the performance the shocks can't seem to give them 
miles where I like them. They seem to be really st st stiff, I guess. But I guess also still good. Dial the compression down again. So and see what that does. I tried with the air down on 65, but oh my gosh, that was awful. See, it didn't soak that up at all. That is not good. It's got a kicker. <laughs> All right, so got the 85 KTM 85 suspension on here. I'm feeling pretty good about how I have it dialed. So now I'm gonna, it's my first time riding any gnarly stuff. This is Humble Pie Trail, and it is tough So we did some gnarly stuff and back into trail four, which is a flowy trail now. Try to see how it feels. It performed really well, I think, in the gnarly stuff, much better than it has been. And it's feeling pretty good in the flow. It's not pushing out in the turns like it was. I think I went too far. I went too soft on my rebound, which causing it to kind of push out in the turns because I think I was blowing through the rebound and didn't have any more to give. It wasn't, it wasn't returning fast enough. So I uh, sped the return my rebound back up two clicks. Not exactly sure where I'm at now. I think I'm at about 18 on the rebound. And then for the compression, I think I'm 22 out on the compression and I've got my air. Hey! Woo. Left turn, Clyde. That's awesome. I got my air set at 65.5, I believe. So it feels pretty good, so I'm good enough to where I can pick up my leave it here, see if I can get used to it. I might go one click softer on the compression, I think. See what that does. Because it feels pretty good, but maybe it could feel better. So I got a little bit of a dive to it, you know, when I just a little bit when I hit my when I hit my front brake, it dives just a little bit, which I like. Because that helps me to uh, kind of lighten up the rear end and steer with the brake, the rear brake. So I hit my front brake, lightens the rear end up, going into the corner. And I can slide the rear end around a little easier. Right here, this one's this one kind of sends you up a little bit. Woo! <laughs>
<laughs> really enjoying jumping these mud holes. They're kind of sketchy, but they're fun. Only expert class idiots allowed at this time of day and temperature.